Hey guys, what's up? Beast from Beast Toys here. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Hit that like and subscribe button if you want to get more notifications of my reviews. Got a Merman uh, cartoon version. As you can see, uh, shoved in a small Amazon box. Go figure, right? Amazon never fails. You want an opener, go to Amazon. And you want an okay price, go to Amazon. You want quality, if you want uh, collector quality grade, no. Absolutely not. Amazon will screw you every time. So, at any rate, here we go. I'm opening him, so I'm not as upset with the bent. I mean, part of me was when I opened him a while ago, I was like, you gotta be kidding me. I mean, I'm like, really, Amazon? But I'm like, I guess it's a good thing I'm opening because this is where I'm at. So, here we go. Filmation Cartoon Collection Merman. He's he's hot off the press. He's pretty fresh. Um, I've, I've only seen one of these kind of figures in store so far that was at a, a walmart just south of me um excuse me i was in there sunday today's what wednesday yeah i was in there sunday this past sunday and there was a tila so part of me wonders did they have the uh what whatever his name is and terror and uh the claw guy Gra lord grasp i think it was um I don't know. Part of me wants to think, yeah, but part of me also says, I don't think so, you know. Well, I just haven't had any luck with He-Man around Walmart. And my Walmart, surprisingly, my Walmart's a pretty good uh, collector for collector stuff. We don't get a bunch, but we usually get one of something, um, you know, Black Series we were always getting. We still get quite a bit of Star Wars, but Joe's weren't haven't been as good, and I think... You know, and I think here's here's I'm gonna make a quick point because I'm gonna move along from that, um, and it goes along the same lines. Joe's for my Walmart was we were stuck with the stupid Baroness and uh, Lady J retros forever and ever, and you know they didn't sell, so they're set on they're still sitting on them. They're in my clearance aisle now. Um, they're still like fifteen bucks. No one's gonna buy them. But and then the Masters you had that wave so was a wave seven, the Jitsu wave and all that, and I think they're in the clearance aisle too. And I'm like. I think that's why we're getting screwed, or my my Walmart, I'm getting screwed on this. The Star Wars stuff eventually goes, so it is what it is. But here we go. So here's my man. Sorry, I don't have my tray up. Um, you know, I want you to look at my old ass legs, as someone commented one time. I can't help it. Uh, I got a ton of Joe's sitting on there, and I've got to organ reorganize a bunch of stuff. I'm basically I'm I'm running low on room. I've been selling. I just sent uh, about a thousand dollars worth of Black Series out the door today. Um, so I've been selling, um, buying. Got some more Joe stuff coming. Um, today's Wednesday, Friday. It's set to drop Friday. Got. I have been. You know, I've I've backed off a ton on Black Series, but I do have Black Series stuff coming. So I know I'll have a review or two later on down the road. For black series um you know i got one sitting here i don't i don't know if i should do a review on it I, I know i've opened all three figures so i'm kind of just not sure that i want to mess with it anyway so we're gonna we're gonna get this open so here is the mini comic merman and stratos of course that wave this is the wave so i'm sitting on three out of four just like the first wave uh i still don't have a he-man I refuse to pay 30 bucks for him because that's about most of the places that's what we're sitting on is $30 for He-Man. I'm not paying 30 for that. When I look at what happened with with the, with the first He-Man in the Origins line sitting on shelves going for next to nothing. Skeletor Skeletor is the one that really got screwed and he got to sit on shelves forever. I think I bought an extra one. And I have an extra one still in a pack in in box, and he said, uh, "Here's his trident." Skeletor sat on a lot of shelves for a very long time, surprisingly. Just 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 saying, longer than He Man, unfortunately. But but there were He Mans out there that got marked down to you know five bucks or five and below, I believe. He comes with this orb. I forget what episode this is from. Actually, it's a marble. It feels like a marble. I almost want, to, but I, my, I've already got I already got teeth issues, so I got a broken one back here, and these aren't real. So, yeah, I know I'm old. Bitching about my old ass legs and talking about my old ass everything. So, 
Um, as seen on, oh, City Beneath the Sea episode. So here's the, uh, here's the back side of it that has that on it. Anyway, let's set that aside. So here we go. Um, you know, it would have been nice to have cartoon accurate as a kid. I guess I just didn't have that technology in the 80s, and, and it is what it is. You know, had I had this, you know, we had these then. And, and, and you know, and to boot, you have this articulation that's really great for it. It's very interesting to see um, these figures come to life, so to speak, um, in the collector's world. So, very cool. So, I think the idea is he's to hold it like this. And I can put the old trident in his hand. So, here's what he looks like. Obviously, we know what the articulation looks like on these guys. You've seen it um, many a times, I'm sure. Uh, you know, here you can twist it here at the foot. Uh, boots are twistable, obviously. Um, el our elbows, shoulders, wrists, head, waist. So there's a there's your whole look. You know, there's not really a ton of stuff to do for these figures as far as showing them off. You know, there's this back side if you want to kind of get a look at what's, what's in the back. But not a ton of stuff to show off for these figures. My reviews for these are always fairly short. You know, I could go over and talk fancy about the articulation or something, blah, blah, blah. I really don't give a crap about that, to be honest with you. I'm not trying to be rude, just saying. You get the point. If you're a collector, you just really want to see what it looks like, right? I mean, that's what I would be looking for. That's how I am. I just want to see what he looks like out of the package and how cool he looks and if he's one of those like hey i gotta have that so anyway so there we go guys there is our masters of the universe merman filmation cartoon collection figure straight from the uh, depths of amazon and their bad packaging so <laughs> anyway i just had to throw it out there so there he is guys good looking figure though um you know i love having the, adding these guys to my collection so there he is but all right, guys. Hey, go ahead and be like I said, give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And thanks for watching, guys, with Filmation Merman. I'm B from Beast Toys. We'll see you.